Hello everybody, this is your back and buddy Pratik. So today we will learn how we can send any email uh, using the SendGrid, Twilio SendGrid API. So we will use the SendGrid uh, packages in the Go programming language and we'll see like how we can send uh, sample emails into that, okay? And uh, yeah, if you are new to this channel, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also I have created a uh, golang quick reference pdf ebook so you can enroll it uh, free via your backendbuddy.com website so let's learn how we can uh, send email using the send grid so here is the example of golang uh, how we can send email using the send grid so uh, initially like few uh, import packages will be required so those are the send grid uh, send grid go and the send grid go helper mail so these two mainly packages required uh, from the send grid side so you can check uh, on this website also like uh, github.com send grid uh, repo package you can check so you will get all the steps so this mainly two packages require send grid go and the send grid go helpers main mail not main but mail okay so uh, now uh, yeah this is just sample i have given but uh, now you will when you register your send grid uh, account uh, after your verification you will get one api key uh, like you can create any api key uh, from the account settings so you can go to the account setting and you can create an API key that will be visible only once. So you can copy that API key. This is the dummy I have just used for your example. So you can store that API key uh, for the sending uh, any email. Okay. So now uh, if we go next, then yeah, here is the from like from whom we are you are sending. So you have to give the from things. So backend buddy its name and the email ID from whom. So here mail, so this helpers.mail, we are using mail.new email. So it will be in the from. Now you can write any subjects, what will be subjects of the email. So you can write here, then to, to whom we are sending uh, this email. So again, we will use mail.new uh, email and it's their name or if you have name available, then uh, email ID of that particular person. So from which email we as uh, user will able to see and to whom you are sending that email ID will be there. Now these two things for just explanation, like uh, if you add simple the things, then it will be in the plain text will be there. And if you want some formatting, then you can use the HTML content. So uh, kind of that way you can add your HTML contents here and you can pass that things. And uh, so for here uh, message, uh, we will use message uh, equal to mail dot new single email. Okay, new single email will be there. And here you can pass from, then your subject, then to, then plain text, and then HTML content you can use. Okay, now uh, once your message is prepared, now you will require to create a client, SendGrid client, okay. So for that, we will require this API key. So for time being, just for your understanding, I have added here, but ideally you have to store into your environment variable for the security purpose. Otherwise, if someone get those API key, then it will be security risk will be there. So, but here for the example, I have uh, added here in the code only. So now you can use sendgrid dot new send client and here you can pass your API key. Okay. So our client will be created. So two things required to clear one message message using the from to subject and its content. Okay. And then client uh, using the API key. So these two things we have created. Now we can send using the sendgrid client. So client dot send and th then you can pass your message whatever you have prepared from here. So it will uh, send the email to particular uh, whatever in the two is there to that it will send the email and it will give the response and you can print the response here. And if there is an error, then it will print here the error. So uh, in the summary note, like if you want to send any email using the send grid Twilio, then you can import this packages and you can from the setting API key, you can create your send grid API key. Okay. So that you can use uh, here uh, in the creating the send grid client. Then you have to just 
uh, from to and then subjects whatever you want uh, you can create those things and create your own message like mail.new single email and pass this content and then client created using the send grid dot new send client and using the api key then directly you can client dot send a message and it will send the email i hope you understand the concept and if you have any doubt then write in the comment so whenever i get time i will reply you and if you are new and not subscribed to my youtube channel please subscribe to my youtube channel it will give me a motivation to deliver you more backend development content and don't forget to press on the bell icon and yeah i have also created the golang quick reference book a uh, pdf file so you can visit to the yourbackendbuddy.com i have given link in the description also so you can register your email and you will get your golang quick reference pdf on your email so See you in the next lecture. Thank you.